Democrats plan boycott of Trump's State of the Union, you won't be surprised who they are. Three members of the House of Representatives have announced they will not attend President Donald Trump's State of the Union address to Congress on January 30. All three cite President Trump's recent comments on immigration, as well as his recent behavior, as the reason they are not attending. Rep. Maxine Waters, D.C.A., Rep. John Lewis, D. E. Ga, and Rep. Earl Blumina or, D. Orr, have all announced they will boycott the State of the Union speech to send the president a message. All three have been vocal critics of the president since he took office. Blumina or boycotted the Trump inauguration, and Lewis boycotted the speech last year. Fox News reports. Rep. Maxine Waters, Democrat California, on Friday became the latest Democrat to announce that she will not be attending President Trump's State of the Union address later this month, amid growing Democratic plans to protest the event. Why would I take my time to go and sit and listen to a liar? Waters said on MSNBC. To someone who lies in the face of facts, someone who can change their tune day in and day out. What does he have to say that I would be interested in? I don't trust him. I don't appreciate him and I wouldn't waste my time sitting in that house listening to what he has to say. He does not deserve my attention. Waters is the third Democrat so far to announce a boycott of the Jan 30 event, with Rep. John Lewis, Democrat Georgia, and Rep. Earl Blumina or, D. Orr, both saying that they would be skipping it too. Lewis made his announcement Friday, citing reports that Trump had referred to some African countries as us polls in a conversation with lawmakers about immigration. I cannot in all good conscience be in a room with what he has said about so many Americans, Lewis said on MSNBC Friday. I just cannot do it. I wouldn't be honest with myself. Blumina or said he would be skipping the event before Trump's remarks became public, but said it would be a waste of time and that he was staying home. Rather than listening to another destructive, divisive speech by Trump, I will not attend this year's annual address to Congress, Blumina or said in a statement. Instead, like I did during his inauguration, I'll be working at home listening to Oregonians about what they think about the State of the Union. The boycott isn't the only protest planned, with some Democrats planning on wearing black in order to stand in solidarity with victims of sexual harassment. Rep. Jackie Spire, Democrat California said she is trying to keep momentum going following last Sunday's protest at the Golden Globe Awards ceremony. ceremony.